she eating everybody else up right now. Everybody on that stage is getting eaten up by her right now. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. For today's video, we're going to be reacting to High School Musical, the series, season one, episode one. I'm a little nervous. I don't know. Is it going to be as good as High School Musical, the movie? I don't know because those movies were actually pretty good, but I don't know. We're about to find out. So without further ado, make sure you guys like and subscribe and let's get right into the video. Yeah. Why is she watching a video? <laughs> I'm like, is this how we're starting it off? Like she is watching High School Musical at like the school? <laughs> Hell yeah. Junior year, baby. My girl mustache. I do a lot of things. Dude, I'm talking about Nini. Today's the day we start over. Based on first impressions, the redhead is cringy. It means a new to you. I think it's good. Yeah. <laughs> I know who that is, Nini. Girl, I am like 0.2 seconds. So the guy, I don't know names yet. So Joshua, he's basically like, oh yeah, I'm so excited to go see Olivia. And then Olivia's talking about another guy. So I'm like, I'm confused. Like, is she cheating? Like, what's going on? Or does Joshua just think that they're dating and they're really not? Um, can we talk? It was my idea to take a pause, okay? Nini was going to theater camp. Not to brag. Okay. So they took a pause, basically. So they took a break. We were on a break. It's giving very much Ross and Rachel vibes. But it seems like he's ready to come back from the break. And she done found a whole new man, though. T. Hang out with a couple girls this summer, possibly. Not Sorry. other girls. Alexa played driver's license by Olivia. Hold on. Would you mean other girls? So see, he was messing around too. But when he says stop, he thinks that that means that she has to stop. And I don't think it's going to end up that way. What she didn't do? Did my feet stink? Was I feeling like my feet stink? No. Sort of. Yeah? I think it's cute. Why is this so cringy, though? What's going on? Why are they talking about feet? <laughs> I'm like, what's going on? I, I don't even know. So she wrote a whole song, I guess, for him. I'm like, what if it just like cuts it good for you? <laughs> but no, but like, so she wrote a song for him, I guess. And now for a special introduction. This year, East High has a new drama teacher with an announcement that she swore in writing would not cost too much money. Not your girl, Ernie from George Lopez up in here as the principal. Okay, I'm like, okay, you know what? This may be a little interesting after all. <laughs> Inspired as a director and triggered as a millennial. Millennial? <laughs> I don't want to be me. I'm not going to say anything, but like. <laughs> Excuse me. Is there somewhere you're supposed to be? Broadway. <laughs> he said Broadway, period, right? <laughs> That teacher did not like that answer, though. Knock, knock, Miss Jen. Just wanted to report that the high school musical hashtag I started is already trending. Why does the teacher keep making faces, though, in the background? I'm like, is he homophobic? Or does he just not like musicals? Or, like, did they cut, like, his program to get more money for the musical? Like, I'm not understanding, but I'm like, there's some sort of beef right there. Wow. Did I not tell you she's amazing? She is amazing. You're amazing. Okay, so crazy idea. What if we went in costume to the audition store? First of all, the black girl, she probably the best character because she's funny. Um, second of all, the guy, he's trying to go in costume. And I'm like, I hope they don't be out there looking stupid because I really don't want them looking stupid out here. I'm like, they're going to show up in like some full costumes. I'm like, mm mm. I go to for advice. He's currently on our honeymoon in the cafeteria. <laughs> Yeah. 
So basically he's trying to win back his girlfriend, but it's like his girlfriend is over here being all happy or whatever with EJ. And um, so now it's going to be some rivalry, I guess. It's going to be some beef going on. I don't know. Maybe they're going to fight. I'm not sure. There's obviously something about Green Herd that feels off limits. So maybe she has some type of like stage fright or something. And Grandma's like trying to tell her. The Grandma's like, listen, like you can do this, right? But it seems like Nini is just psyching herself out. Like she's just always in her head too much. But it's like if she just got out of her head, she could probably be like really good. I mean, is he kidding with this? Shouldn't he be on an airplane right now to Chicago? Shouldn't he be fighting to, to save this? So Ricky's parents, I guess, are going to get a divorce or something like that. I guess there's some drama going on with that. So he's like trying to focus on this now. He can't even worry about trying to get Nene back or whatever. But really, I don't think he should anyway, because it's like he kind of lost his chance. So I hate musicals. I just think it's weird when people like burst in a song in the middle of the street. Dude, that's a musical. OK, look, I'm auditioning for this thing tomorrow. So he thinks the smartest thing for him to do is to audition for the musical. He doesn't even like musicals. He may embarrass himself. Can he sing? Can he dance? Can he act? We don't know. Okay, so he may just go out there and full-on embarrass himself for Nene. Dang, who is that in the front though? Y'all were just telling us some we don't have no competition. Who is that? Because she eating everybody else up right now. Everybody on that stage is getting eaten up by her right now. She what that she's in the front. She's like do, 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 ready to go. I think that she's gonna get Gabriella. Um, not yet, but uh, this summer at camp, I went on to believe that she got Lundgren salmonella, so <laughs> I'm ready. Great story. I thought that was shade. She was like, oh, like, great story. Like, I thought that that was some shade right there because I was just kind of like, okay, and, like, you must be threatened then, right? Or you're just the mean girl of the show, I guess. Maybe that's what it's giving. Give him the tray stuff, he'll be great. And uh, how about we have you read for Kelsey? Listen, that's shade. First of all, I love Kelsey. Kelsey ate her part all the way up, but like, come on now. Like, she wants to play Gabriella, so stop trying to downplay her like that and trying to make her this little side character, okay? She wants to be Gabriella. You're reading for Ryan, right? I think he'd rather play Sharpay. I love him. That is so funny. Love that. Love that. I wonder how they're going to do that. Is it going to be like a drag moment going on? Or are they going to make Sharpay like a boy character? Because that could be interesting too. Well, I'm excited to see that. But I'm like, okay. Okay, High School Musical, the series. We see you. <laughs> Pause. Yeah. Uh, you know, I, I feel like She said, I love you. He said, let's take a break. She said, I love you. He said, let's take a break. Really? See, that doesn't even make any sense. Anything can happen when you take a chance. The fact that the power goes out and he gets a flashlight up there to save her. I'm like, okay. Now, I don't know whose team I'm on. I'm like, okay, Ricky. I'm like, I still don't like Ricky. But, like, that's a nice moment right there. I never open my heart. Now, here comes EJ trying to one-up Ricky. It's like, EJ, sit down. Just let them have this little moment. But it's like, I get it because he's like, that's my girl. Stop trying to come up in here and steal my girl, okay? So, I definitely understand EJ's perspective. Maybe you can't stop beating yourself up for totally blowing it. Look. So he's trying to fix it in the monologue right now. She's not really buying it. She's just kind of like, yeah, whatever. I'm over it. Yes, I think you kind of, you know. I think you kind of, you know. So now he's singing the song that she wrote for him. 
Um, I don't know. I don't know if he's going to be able to win her back. I feel like this is just not going to work. I think you kind of, you know. I think you kind of, you know. Okay. Well, let me tell you about the old me. All right, the old me had a heartbroken. I feel bad for her because she's like, kind of like, she's just sitting here. She's just like, listen, I don't want to see you again. You broke my heart. She finally is moving on. And it's like, here he comes back. Talking about, oh, I love you. Da, 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 da. Okay, but like, it's too late. Always get on the underdogs. The girl looks mad. So I'm thinking that Nini got Gabriella, which I mean, good for her. You know what? Because she earned it. She thinks I'm a Chad. So, if EJ's Chad, that means Ricky is Troy. <laughs> oh my gosh, T. <laughs> I don't know how that's going to work, but I guess we're going to see. Okay, guys, we are at the end of the video. Um, Honestly, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. It's cringy. Um, but honestly, I can see myself kind of watching this, just kind of seeing what else is there. Um, I think everybody sings well. I want to see how they finish up this musical. So, you know, if you guys are liking this up and it's getting some pretty good views, then I'm going to keep reacting. So you guys need to make sure that you guys like and subscribe if you haven't already. Okay, share this with your friends. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. I think you kind of, you know. I think you kind of, you know.